This is officially Hagrid's beard level of volume. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. I'm sorry about my lip line. It's huge. Half my face is covered in lipstick. I'm sorry, but y'all welcome to my channel. Today is going to be a Boxy Lux unboxing. And with all of my unboxing videos, I always come on with the look I created with my box so I can do the unboxing portion. And if you guys are interested in seeing the try on portion, this is what I created. And I will always have that time stamped above. I'll do it now so you guys can see and jump to that if you guys are interested in try on styles. So this month's Boxy Lux is a getaway themed box. It has a really cute little paper here. We, woo, look at all these. <sighs> okay, so let's go ahead and start with the Tarte Tartist Pro Glow Cheek Palette version three. This palette is beautiful. So this has two really beautiful kind of baby pink blushes, two versions of highlights, a more pinky toned one and a more gold one. And it does have a pretty orange bronzer and a shimmery bronzer. Although on my skin, it, it gave it a beautiful sun-kissed glow. And this is $45, you guys. The next thing is Touch and Soul No Problem Prime Essence. This is infused with Calendula Flower Extract, and it's supposed to tighten up your pores and keep your skin silky smooth. So here is that. Now I am almost finished with my Holy Grail Primer right here, which is also Touch and Soul No Problem, but this one is significantly different. Here is that one as you can see it is very runny and that is $23 the next is Dominique Cosmetics lemonade lip gloss and this is in the color peach tea and this is $17 you guys and actually I am giving this gloss away if you guys have already seen my giveaway video, then you know what I'm talking about. If not, I am actually giving these two babies away, but I am giving the Neon Orange Obsessions Palette from Huda Beauty away and this gloss. Look how pretty these will be together. They will be so beautiful. So if you guys are interested in winning this orange palette, and this gloss in a little fun summary combo, I will have that video linked above. And you guys make sure to go enter that because this is a beautiful palette. The next product is a PYT mini turbo on the go dryer. And you guys, this thing retails for $85. Look how cute it is. Now, I don't normally blow dry my hair, but I just got a puppy and I will definitely style him because um, he's fluffy and he's like a little teddy bear and I definitely just want to make him poof up as big as possible. So uh, yes, I will be using that hair dryer probably on my puppy <laughs> on the lowest setting. Don't worry. The next thing is Dr. Brandt Clean Biotic pH Balance Yogurt Cleanser with Chlorophyll. That's awesome. Let the plants do the dirty work. I like that. Here is this, and this retails for $35. A $35 cleanser? Yes, please. But also Dr. Brandt is an amazing skincare line. So I'm really excited to use this. I still have my Glam Glow from last month's Boxy Charm, so I've got to get through that first. The next thing is Pharmacy Honeymoon Glow AHA Resurfacing Night Serum, and this is 30 milliliters. Now you guys, this is really cool. It's got 14% AHA and BHA, which is alpha hydroxy and beta hydroxy. Those help exfoliate your skin, and this also has a gentle flower acid blend. So you get youthful looking smooth complexion as the look of pores, fine lines, and wrinkles are reduced. So this is actually really beautiful. 
It's very luxurious feeling. It's in like a um, frosted glass bottles and it it just looks really nice. So I'm excited to use this. I'll be using this at night definitely. By the way, if you guys are interested in a skincare routine, I do have one coming up on Monday. If any of you guys are aware, I did graduate esthetician school. I'm not an esthetician yet, but I think I give you guys a lot of tips and tricks for skincare in that video. The, ne the next is Living Proof. Oh, and that was $58. Did I say that? Jeez. Oh, Jeez. The next is Living Proof Full Dry Volume Blast. Okay, well, I mean, as you guys saw in the beginning. Uh, yeah. I got some volume on that. And that's actually really cool because I have fine, thin hair. Sometimes I do want a lot of volume. Hagrid's Beard Level Volume. And there we go. That did it. Thank you, Boxylux. Right, the next is the Tracedeeks Good Vibes Mascara. And you guys, this did have a really fun lash curler on it. It was so cool! If you guys want to see me try this, then make sure to keep watching because this thing was fun. The last thing, oh, and that was $25. The last thing is Skin & Company Truffle Therapy Radiant Dew Mist, and this is $35. This is supposed to help soothe, protect, and illuminate the skin. There's a glow-inducing tonic inspired by the Italian le legend of St. John's Water which is a magical dew produced using flowers and herbs during the summer solstice. So that sounds super special. <laughs> it's, it's very pepperminty. If y'all like some pepperminty sprays, that's what this is. Super pepperminty, but it feels really nice and refreshing after you put it on. If you guys don't like the smell of peppermint, you're going to absolutely hate this but you guys here is the box total <laughs> up here oh my <laughs> and if you guys are interested in seeing me try all these products on then just keep watching as soon as i get this rat nest out of my hair we are gonna do this dry volume because my hair is flat and fine and boring Okay, let's see how this works. Tousle. Yeah, tousle it. Tousle this volume. All right, let's let's tousle this. Oh lord. If you guys see grays, don't judge. I'm pretty sure I'm doing this all all wrong. All wrong. All right. Let's, let's tousle. <laughs> I look like a she-wolf. <laughs> mm -hmm. This is a look, y'all. This is officially Hagrid's beard level of volume. Okay, cool. Now that I look like I got caught in a wind tunnel, let's continue with the rest of these products, shall we? Let's get closer. I obviously, um, we don't want to try this, but I showed it in the beginning. I mean, it's, it's not something that I'm going to use on camera. I don't, it's going to be so loud and obnoxious in your ear. I will use this cleanser tonight and I will see how it works. I'm pretty sure though that this sounds like a wonderful cleanser. This does say that it is a night serum. So obviously I won't be using this right now. So I also cannot try this one on, but I can try this one on. This is the Truffle Therapy Illuminating Skin Refresh Mist. So let's go ahead and do this. This also says that it can be used as a setting spray. So I guess I'll go ahead and put it on now and then set my makeup with this as well because that's what it's, it says it can be a setting spray. Oh. 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 That smells wonderful. Oh, it's cooling. Okay. That... That smells like straight up peppermint. Wow. 
there is a lot of peppermint going on. It's very refreshing. I'm interested to see how this does on my skin as like a base. Mm, mm. Smells, smells really good. <laughs> now for the No Porblum Prime Essence. And it says this is the last step in skincare. So let's go ahead and put this on. It's like see-through pink. It's all fancy looking. Oh, this is weird. Okay. Let's see here. Ooh. Ew. Oh, okay. It is very liquidy. It smells like spa-like. Oh. Oh. It's very slimy. The right word? Yeah, it's slimy. It's kind of like um bedrool. <laughs> I don't use as much as I used, which was three drops. Maybe use two drops. That should be enough. It actually feels nice. Uh, I like it. Ew, it got on my neck. Ew, gross. I feel like someone just slobbered all over my neck. <laughs> but we already know this is going in my giveaway, so I'm not going to be putting that on. And these two are actual makeup items. So I'm gonna do a quick makeup look and I'll be right back and we will put these two on. So with this, I am going to be using, I guess we're gonna use this for a bronzer. It's pretty orange and then, okay, that was rude. And then this one's a little bit more like shimmery so I guess I'll hit the high points on my face afterwards with this. Wow, well, I mean, it's not that bronze. It's pretty orange. Yep, it's pretty orange. Yes. I am very warmed up. Let's go in with the shimmery shade right here. Oh yeah, that definitely gives you a sheen. Nice sun-kissed glow. And I'm gonna go in with this first color right here. gosh, you guys, I forgot to curl them. We'll just do it afterwards. Ooh. It's very black. It's coating the lashes nice and evenly. It's separating them. It's not really adding curl or length, though. Like, there they are. With the curl factor, like that's what that cool little built-in thing is for. So let's try that. I know, I should have done that first, but I completely forgot. I wasn't even thinking. Oh my gosh, you guys. I definitely, definitely should have done this before I put on mascara. Ugh. Okay, like it worked. It, I can definitely see that they're lifted, but it did smush all the mascara together, so. Oops, um, I think it did work though, and because it is so tiny, like you can get sections of your lashes that you're not able to get with the much bigger ones. So I, I, I think I'm gonna be using this like all the time, I'm not even mad. That is all I have for this video, and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye! You know what? I gotta wash my hands real quick. So here is where to go.